The Young, the Restless spoilers. In the past, Victor has killed many people, but he has also stood in place, creating traps and causing his enemies to die in the calculation. But Victor was not bothered by the police, so Victor's enemies are numerous, and he lives in fear and anxiety all the time. Many times, Victor was attacked almost to death or harmed, but his fate was fortunate not to die so soon. Ashlyn's death has so much nonsense, but we also need to find answers. Will Nick and Victoria be the ones who caused his death? Victor always closely monitors the activities of his children, and even Ashland, in a way, is to send people to follow, but they do not know. That's why Victor grasped the situation extremely quickly. As Ashland lies on the floor, Victor's underlings steal the body, much to Nick and Victoria's surprise. Thus, it can be concluded that Victor is holding Ashland, and what will he do next? Ashland is a nasty opponent, making Victor take a lot of effort to destroy, but unsuccessfully, so this is a great opportunity to do just that. Chance and Kevin start to make positive moves. They find some clues from the floor. They confirm that there was a fight at Victoria's house between Ashland and someone. Victor needs to quickly deal with Ashland's corpse or human to avoid causing trouble later. Chance will have no reason to continue investigating this case. What will Victor do with such illegal t- a detention of Ashland? Does he want to kill people? If so, then Victor would be the killer, not his children. Later, if the police arrest Nick, he will also have a reason to plead guilty on behalf of his children. Ashland is alive. He's locked up somewhere with a head wound and no medical attention. Too bad if he gets out. All the crimes of the Newman family will be exposed and everything will no longer be under control.